This is one of countless videos online used to promote fire safety and the dangers around lithium ion batteries. It shows how fast a major fire can erupt after a failure usually caused during charging. The biggest thing is to make sure we, we're using them properly. So making sure you're using the right cables that they came with to charge them, making sure you're not overcharging them, and making sure you're disposing of them properly once they've used their end of life. This video shows an e-scooter being charged before the fire erupts, but rechargeable lithium-ion batteries are in so many everyday electronics and tools now, it's not hard to take their safety for granted. Uh, lithium batteries are essentially in everything that's rechargeable these days, from watches, vacuum cleaners, e-bikes, scooters. And in fire holes across Canada, fires caused by lithium-ion batteries is now one of the biggest concerns. One of the most common causes is using charging devices that did not come with the battery. So making sure you use the right cord that it came with the device or approved from that same manufacturer. Try not to mismatch cables or use a different charger that's not been approved by that manufacturer. These fires are the focus of this year's Fire Prevention Week across Canada. The National Fire Protection Association highlights how important it is to buy, charge and recycle lithium ion batteries safely. So how can you detect there's a problem before there's a big problem? I guess the smoke, the heat would be the first signs of warning. Or you see the batteries bubbling at all. I've seen a, a couple batteries like that. That's just a sign of that the, it's overheating inside. Some of the glue's coming apart. The bigger the battery, the more energy that's stored and the bigger the potential fire. E-bikes are exploding in popularity, but so are some of their batteries. And water is not how to put out a battery fire. If you had a small fire from a lithium battery, you can use an ABC extinguisher or just a multi-cam dry extinguisher. Be sure to call 911 though and uh, make sure the fire is out. We've covered close calls here on Vancouver Island, including this incident in Lanceville where a skateboard that was charging caught fire. Experts say it's also important to properly recycle lithium batteries when they're finished and not send them to the local landfill.